This video is specifically for Vantage integrators, produced with the intent to help you successfully set up the Vantage Equinox Comfort Widget for your clients. The primary requirement for implementing the Comfort Widget involves the insertion of thermostat objects into the project file. Each thermostat will be one of two categories. The first is the Vantage thermostat. There have to date been three generations of Vantage thermostats, all connected to the Vantage system through either a wired or wireless interface station. All of these will work with the Comfort Widget, provided each is represented by the Vantage thermostat object within Infusion Design Center. This is found within Vantage objects, either Station's wire link or Station's radio link. As we insert the thermostat into the desired area, the first consideration for us is to name the thermostat. Typically, we're a little more technical in the name, but I'm just going to, in this case, just simply name it Second Bedroom Thermostat. And then in the display name, the thing to consider is that the word thermostat is redundant because these objects are already represented as thermostats. So we're just going to put in Second Bedroom. Now, um, since the thermostat may be mounted on the wall in the traditional fashion or be, may be remotely mounted with only an unobtrusive sensor at the location, consider using the display name here to represent the HVAC zone, which might be more than a specific room in which the thermostat or sensor is mounted. But once inserted in name, we want to check the options in the object editor, such as uh, what kind of a sensor it is, uh, whether we have an external uh, outdoor sensor and how many heat and cool contacts are on the thermostat. Now don't forget to uh, set up, or better yet, have the HVAC professional on the project set up the physical thermostat for proper system operation. All we have to do at this point is configure the station. There is no programming necessary to implement any of the widget functionality that we've shown. The second thermostat category is third-party thermostats or multi-zone controllers. The corresponding object for each zone of this category is found within the Drivers tab of Design Center, which if we sort in the Category view can be found under the HVAC Category folder. And you'll notice a bunch of EQ or Equinox certified drivers allowing you to interact with third-party um, systems. Now, the, it is important that you consult with Vantage technical support prior to the designing a third-party HVAC system that you want to interface with Vantage. There are many variations on the details of setting up these systems and the representative objects within Design Center, although the considerations that were mentioned in the native Vantage thermostat are somewhat representative of the process that you will go through. So as stated, no programming is necessary to implement the Comfort Widget, but any programming you might have done in the past relative to thermostats is still available to meet your customers' needs. Additionally, there was reference made in the Comfort Widget overview video to the option of schedule holds and schedule resumption programming. As these are new with the introduction of the Comfort Widget, we will review this. We'll first create a task to place all thermostats in the project on hold. Within the programming view, we will create a new task. We'll give it a name. The name we'll give it is HVAC Schedule Hold. And then we use the wizard wand to look at the available functions. I'm going to go to the Name tab where we have a filter, and I'm going to type in the word Schedule we'll see that there are two new procedures uh, that are with Equinox that allow us to operate on the schedules and we are going to clear thermostat schedules. We're going to select every th thermostat on the project. Now this task in and of itself could be assigned to a button on a keypad or with, to a button within an Equinox Scenes widget. Alternatively, it could be launched as part of a multifunctional away mode button on either the Equinox Scenes widget 
or a keypad button. Now we'll want to create a paired task to be able to resume the schedule when, some, when the uh, homeowner arrives home. So we'll create a new one and we'll title it HVAC Schedule Resume. And here we'll be using the other procedure. Look for it again this way and we're going to set the thermostat schedule. Now here it's important that we know what the thermostat schedule that we assign is. And that's something then we'll need to coordinate with the system owner to make sure that we're in agreement with proper schedule to thermostat assignments. Secondly, so let, I'm going to select the two for the kitchen and the great room. Secondly, within the schedule uh, tab here, what we see is that although within Equinox I have changed the names of the schedules, the original naming is held intact. So we need to know the order that those were placed originally in the widget. That order was home, away, vacation, and custom. You'll see that here they're presented alphabetically in a different order. But my new names are primary, secondary, bedroom, and office. So there's the correlation in order of how they were originally presented within the um, widget. Now I'll start with the primary schedule assigned thermostats. So primary for me, as I've already checked, the kitchen and the great room, that corresponds to the home. It's in the first position. And uh, that's one I've substituted for the primary. So we'll select that. Now here for me, I'm going to do a copy and a paste of that line. Here we're going to select, deselect what we had. We'll select the office. And the office rep is replacing the custom. We will also paste for the secondary. Secondary areas are the exercise and the rec room. And those are being given, that's a, a way in the original position. And finally, we have the office, which is in the third position. the vacation position. So we have now completed the uh, programming and as said with the hold we would also do the same thing with the resume. Either give a button for it directly within the widget, the scenes widget or a keypad or we could assign it as part of a multi multifunctional home mode button. I would recommend you assist your homeowner in developing the initial schedules, their names, their times and settings, and the assignment of schedules to thermostats. You will want to review their needs and uses and share with them your plan and rationale. You might want to review the companion tutorial video and depending on their interest, point your clients to that tutorial as well. As is true with the entire series on Equinox widgets, we've created the overview video so that you can point your clients to it. Please feel free to contact us at Vantage if you have any further questions or need for assistance. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.